Well, the whole motivation is about leadership service. What can I do to impact on humanity and leave a mark? I'm always looking forward to doing something impactful that affects humanity in general or a section of humanity. And that is why I mentioned to you that even whilst I was doing my national service at Empire, so where I've been posted to, and I thought that was not the right place for me, a trained civil engineer from KNUST, why should I go and sit at National Service Secretariat office? But I took that opportunity to offer community service by way of teaching. So, it is part of the motivation. And I think that if you have special talent or if you have any talent, that gives you, you know, the leverage to serve humanity. You don't have to check that talent. Make sure that you place it at the service of humanity. You do your part and then you leave the, you exit the scene. So for me, I see politics as a way of offering leadership service. And in leadership service, there are three functions. One, you provide direction as a leader to your followers. You must provide direction. Are we going towards the north? Are we going towards the east? Are we going towards the west? Are we going towards the south? And that direction must be clearly given by the leader. Once you are on that direction, it will not be rosy. So the second function of the leader is to ensure that you inspire your people. You provide inspiration. On the way, there will be challenges. People will begin to murmur. Why are you going in this direction? Why are you not taking us here? You as a leader, you have the vision. Tell them, encourage them, inspire them that we are capable of making it. And across the globe, I mean, there are experiences that we can learn. Singapore, China, they have had very strong leaders who have led their countries and now today, generations are benefiting from their forebears, their forefathers who had their vision. So that is how I get motivated to do my politics. And the last or the third function in terms of leadership service is to seek the welfare of your followers. For every leader, if you provide a direction, if you inspire them, you have to think of what they will eat, what they will wear, where they will sleep. And that should be a function of a leader. So a leader who doesn't think of this, excuse me to say, will he be the right leader? Maybe he may be a selfish leader. But the leader will think about the generality of the followers in improving the quality of life.